Welcome to another book review. If you have not already, please tap that subscribe button so you can be notified every time I release a new podcast episode or a new YouTube video. Today, it is all about The Escape Room by Megan Golden. This is the second book I've read by Megan Golden. The first one was The Night Swim, one that I recently reviewed here on the podcast and the YouTube channel. I read this book as a buddy read with a friend and we said, hey, this is awesome. We gave it five stars, let's read her other one. That's when The Escape Room came into play. And if you look at the cover, it looks like a woman is peeking in between a door or two walls. This is actually in an elevator. The elevator is the quote unquote escape room. And I'm putting this in air quotes because it's not a real escape room. It is a place where somebody is getting revenge on four coworkers, but they believe it is an escape room at first. Half of the book is present time in the escape room, AKA the elevator. And these four people who work together are trying to decide why they are in this room, why is somebody coming after them, who knows their secrets, and how much of these secrets are known. The other half of the book is back in time. We're finding out about how shady these four people are. They are so into their work as investment bankers. There's a lot of greed. There's a lot of just bad behavior, bad professional behavior, and it affects other people that they work with. And some of these other people that they worked with back in the day are coming back to haunt them in a few more ways than one. Without giving a lot away, because I don't do spoilers here, it's a great book. If you like thrillers, if you like psychological thrillers, if you like mystery and you want to figure things out as you read and you like a quick read, you're going to like The Escape Room. Just like Megan Golden's The Night Swim, I give The Escape Room five stars. I read this one pretty quickly just because it was pretty good. It was pretty good. I am going to say I had a couple of ideas about who the bad guy was. I don't really think the bad guy in this book is really a bad guy. I kind of like how it ended because it kind of, um, I don't know if I want to say justified what happened in the book, but I like the way it ended. There is a sad part. Not all of the deaths in this book are created equal. Some I wish didn't happen. Some I wasn't too sad about, if I'm being honest. The Escape Room is a good one. Five out of five stars. Megan Golden, I believe you have only written two books. And I am excited to read more. So keep them coming, honey. Because these are good. The Escape Room was the first book that she wrote. And then she wrote The Night Swim. So... Now I've read both of them. I read them out of order. Moving forward, I will read them in order. The Escape Room's a good one. If you have not already, make sure you visit my blog at christinaallday.com and I link to the book where you could buy it on Amazon. Follow me on Instagram at christinaallday. Tell me what you are reading. I love a good book recommendation. My to be read list is long and I'm trying to do at least a book a week. And when you get a book like this one, you do it a lot quicker than a week. Thank you so much for watching and listening. Please tap that subscribe button so you are notified every time a new podcast goes live or a new YouTube video goes live. And remember, if you ever want to see more book reviews or what I'm doing, just head over to christinaallday.com or find me on Instagram at christinaallday.